hi now we are going to log into our admin panel and there we see a new update as you can see there is a red notification under updates that shows update to new version that is 6.03 all you have to do is to simply click this and it will start updating what it will do it will download the update from the repository just like windows or any other application updates if you try to access the wordpress during those updates it will give you an error but you can see it went into this uh, it went into maintenance mode after maintenance mode it updated successfully and it gave us the new updates news whatever update has been performed so what is new in this uh, wordpress release version 6.0.3 is you can check under news 6.0.3 so it is basically a security release to get latest security release automatic you can switch to automatic updates for maintenance and security releases only if you click that on your wordpress installation now you will receive automatic updates for security and maintenance release from now on if you want to enable automatic updates for all versions that means any update that happens that your website or your wordpress site will automatically be updated switch to enable automatic mode for all versions so there are two options that you can switch to the security versions only or all versions we better remain on all version but what is under 6.03 it is mainly a security update that includes security uh, the stored xss xss is cross site scripting via wp mail that means excuse me that means uh, the stored uh, cross site scripting that could have been done by the, the mail or how you send the post through email that has been blocked or updated open redirect that is wp ignorance that is closed sender email address is exposed in wp mail that has been uh, closed so it is not no more exposed in this after this update so you have to get the security releases as soon as they get in so better switch to automatic updates uh, there is something under media library that reflected cross-site scripting and SQLi that has been uh, closed CRF in WP backtrack backtracks uh, trackbacks are uh, the links that you get to the other websites or other websites get to your wordpress csrf is also cross site scripting uh, that is done on the website the stored cross site scripting via the customizer so we we could use the cross site scripting previously but now it is not enabled it has been uh, closed revert shared user instances that was uh, introduced in this version or this release if you click that one and let's open and see you will see a lot more details yes there you can see this is mainly for i believe pro users for uh, normal users let's move on stored cross-site cross -site scripting in wordpress via co, co in wordpress core via comment editing people could 
uh, use comments under the page or the post and use cross-site scripting. Data exposure via REST API. REST is an <coughs> API. Terms, tags, or endpoints. Content for multi-part email leak that has also been closed. SQL injection due to improper sanitization of WP date query that has been closed. RSS widget stored under XSS has been uh, uh, closed. Stored so it is mainly cross-site scripting SXXSS in the search block cross-site scripting in the image block cross-site scripting in RSS and fix the widget block for cross-site scripting so mainly there was a huge uh, cross-site cross -site scripting issue that has been closed or that was discovered and has been closed now and these are the contributors who made these changes of these security updates possible thank you very much for watching